Hey guys, Corel Cooper here with OnTheBlack.com. Today is Monday, August 31st, 2009. So last week on Twitter, I asked Mets fans uh, if they're going to watch the Mets for the remainder of the season. I mean, the team is 59 and 72. Uh, they're decimated with injuries and they're really just playing out the string here. To my surprise, pleasantly surprised, most Mets fans said that yes, they will continue to watch the games for the remainder of the season and follow the team. So what I wanted to do in today's post was give you guys five reasons in, in, no, in no particular order, but five reasons why I'm going to stay interested in the Mets and watch them play out the string here in September. Okay, so one is Bobby Parnell. I'm interested to see how Parnell does for, for the remainder of this season. As you guys know, if you follow my, my videos on ontheblack.com, you know that I'm tracking each of Parnell's starts. And the reason why I'm doing that is because going into the offseason and looking ahead to next year, right now there are only three sure things in the Mets rotation, three sure pitchers, which is uh, Santana, Pelfrey, and Perez. So there's really two spots up for grabs. I'm hoping that the Mets will fill at least one of those spots through free agency and bring in uh, a solid number two pitcher behind Santana. And then there's, you know, one spot will be left. You figure guys like Jonathan Nice will, will vie for that spot, uh, but Parnell can also throw his hat in the ring. He's got good stuff. Uh, you know, he, he struggled in his, his few starts he's had so far, but I want to see if he can make a push for that fifth spot, or is he really just a, you know, a bullpen guy? So we'll see. You know, another reason why I'm going to continue to watch the Mets is I want to see if they can hold off the Washington Nationals and not finish in last place. Right now, the Mets have a, a 13 game lead over the Nationals, uh, you know, but I don't want to see the Mets finish dead last in the in the NL East. So hopefully they can they can hold off the Nationals, you know, on sort of the same note. A third reason why I'm going to stay interested in the Mets is I want to see them play a little bit of a spoiler here in the month of September. You know, obviously the last two seasons they've had their their season spoiled. But, you know, in September, they play teams like the Phillies, uh, they play Florida, and they play uh, a couple other teams that are pushing uh, for the wild card position. So I want to see the Mets uh, play a little bit of a spoiler role and, uh, you know, hurt some other teams' playoff chances, just like our chances have been hurt the last uh, few seasons. Uh, the fourth reason why I'm going to stay interested in the Mets is I'm looking forward to their September call-ups. Uh, specifically Josh Tolley. Uh, you know, word is he's been tearing up double A. Um, he's a catcher. Want to see him come up in September and see what he can do. Uh, this will be Schneider's last year as a Met, I'm hoping. Uh, so there's an open uh, spot at the catcher position if you figure Santos is going to fill one spot. You know, and if if Tolley can show that he can play at this level in the month of September, you know, that may fill one of the Mets' needs going into the offseason, which is a, a catcher position. So interested to see uh, September call-ups and how the Mets do there. And the fifth and final reason why I'm interested in watching the Mets here throughout September is to see who comes back. You know, we already know, obviously, that Santana and Jose Reyes are done for the season. Wright is reported that he will come back tomorrow. Uh, the guy that I want to see whether or not he comes back or not is Beltran. Uh, you know, I know that there's been debate between Mets fans about just shutting down guys that are injured. I'm a fan of bringing guys back if they're healthy. One, they get paid to play. And two, I think it does something for the morale of the team going into the offseason and looking ahead to next year if you can have some of your stars come back. So obviously, again, we know Santana and Reyes are not coming back. But I'm interested to see if Beltran will come back this year uh, and play for the Mets down the stretch. So those are my five reasons why I'm going to stay interested in the Mets and watch them throughout the month of September. Would love to hear uh, your reasons for staying interested in the Mets. Whether you agree with these reasons, you have other reasons to add, let me know, and I'll talk to you guys soon.